arrivals at Mammoth Sugar Bowl Stadium are entertained by the various musical contingents participating in the pageantry. First, the American Legion Band, under the direction of Howard Voorhees, performs. Now the famed Black Watch Pipes and Drum Corps of Canada go through a precision drill. LSU's Fighting Tiger football squad begins its pre-game preparations. Followed by the Syracuse University Orange Men. LSU coach Charles McClendon and Captain Richard Granier discuss battle plans. And here's coach Ben Schwartzwalder of Syracuse. Dr. William Pete Tolley, Chancellor of Syracuse University, is shown as he awaits the kickoff. Dr. John A. Hunter, President of Louisiana State University. President A. Theo Momus crowns charming Lynn Bowman, Queen of the 1965 Sugar Bowl. All fans stand as the Right Reverend Gerald M. Jones, Episcopal Bishop of Louisiana, delivers the prayer for peace. Marguerite Piazza, internationally famed singing star, sings the national anthem. All musical organizations participate on the field under band director Bill Schwar of Louisiana State University. cheers from their followers. Syracuse captains Rich King and Billy Hunter meet with LSU captain Richard Granier at the center of the field. LSU wins the toss, elects to receive. Syracuse will kick off and defend the south goal. And here's the kickoff to start the 1965 Sugar Bowl game. Smith boots it for Syracuse to the LSU 12-yard line. Schwab fumbles, recovers, and then returns to the LSU 22. But on the play, LSU is penalized half the distance to their goal line. Flipping. After two runs, gain only two yards, with third down and eight yards to go, LSU shifts into punt formation. Buster Brown punts for the Tigers to midfield. Charlie Brown takes it, and he's stopped by Granier with no return. The kick good for 37 yards. First and 10 Syracuse, Rich King, the quarterback. He passes to Maley, complete for nine yards to the LSU 41. Vincent and Rice making the stop. That makes it second down, a yard to go. King pitches to Jim Nance, who goes over right guard for three yards, and it's a first down on the LSU 38, stopped by Rice and Carmier. First and 10, King pitches to Wally Maley, and he gains five at left end to the LSU 33. Vincent and Rodriguez make the tackle. With second and five, King pitches back to Floyd Little. He sweeps right end and gains eight yards to the LSU 25, and it's a first down Syracuse. Rodriguez and Joseph make the stop. With a first and 10 now, King hands off to Little. He takes off around right end and goes 18 yards to a first down on the LSU 7. Benson and Joseph tackle him. First and goal for the Orange men. King pitches to Maley. He tries left end, goes to the Tiger 2, but Syracuse is guilty of holding and penalized 15 yards to the LSU 19. Still first and goal, but the goal line 19 yards away. King gets 11 yards back with a pass to Clark to the Tiger 8. Vincent makes a tackle. King pitches back to Little. He tries right tackle, gains a yard, LSU 7, stopped by Pillow and Moore. With third and goal, King the quarterback rolls to the left. He passes to Clark in the end zone, and it's broken up by Joseph. With fourth down, goal to go, Chernovitz holding, Smith kicks a 23-yard field goal from a side angle. With nine minutes, 10 seconds left to play in the first period, Syracuse leads LSU three to nothing. Smith kicks off for Syracuse to the LSU six-yard line. 
Bruzzo gathers it in and returns 14 yards to the Tiger 22 with Brown making the stop. Tigers on the attack now. They trail three to nothing, unable to make a first down in three attempts. With fourth and 11 at the Tiger 21, Brown drops back into punt formation. Brown punts to the Syracuse 42. Majori roars in, jars the ball loose from Maley, and Granier recovers for the Tigers. The kick good for 37 yards. Screen in at quarterback now. The Tigers attacking. He pitches back to Labruzzo. He gains three yards at right end to the Syracuse 39. Stopped by Fair. Second and seven. Screen hands off to Schwab. He gains a yard at right tackle to the Syracuse 38. Guggenhagen makes the tackle. Third and six. Man in motion to the left. Screen rolls to the left. He passes intended for Labruzzo. Incomplete. That makes it fourth and six for the Tigers. And LSU shifts to punt formation. Brown punts to the Syracuse three-yard line, where Prudham rounds the ball. A kick good for 35 yards. King of Syracuse pitches back to Little. He's thrown in the end zone by Rice for a three-yard loss and an LSU safety. With five minutes, eight seconds remaining in the first period, Syracuse three, LSU two. King punts to the LSU 27-yard line following the safety. Labruzzo returns 20 yards to the Tiger 47, where he is stopped by Rowe. After a line play gets only one yard and two passes fail, with fourth and nine, Brown punts into the Syracuse end zone for a kick of 32 yards. The Orange men will take it out on their 20-yard line. First and 10, Syracuse. But unable to move the ball with fourth and one, King punts out of bounds on the LSU 44. The kick is for 27 yards. LSU takes over, sends a man in motion to the right, screen in the pocket, passes intended for Labruzzo, but it's broken up by Brown. With second and 10, screen hands off to Labruzzo, who tries left guard and gains five to the LSU 49. Stopped by Chianski. Third and five, screen back to pass. Can't find a receiver, is forced to run at right end. Pat gains six yards and a first down on the Syracuse 45. Hunter trips him up and screen goes out of bounds. First and 10 for the Tigers. Screen pitches back to the Betta. The Betta at left end gains two to the Syracuse 43. Stucker making the stop. With second and eight, screen hands off to the Betta. He tries right guard and picks up three more to the Syracuse 40. Stopped by Smith. With third and five, screen fakes, rolls out to the right. His pass is intended for Doug Morrow, but it's incomplete. Fourth and five, and Brown drops back into punt formation. His punt is blocked by Riley. Clark recovers in the LSU 28-yard line, and with Winky assisting with a crucial block on Vincent, he goes all the way for a touchdown with just four seconds remaining in the first quarter. Chernovitz holding, Smith kicks, it's good. Syracuse leads LSU 10 to two. Smith kicks off for Syracuse. Labruzzo takes it on the LSU six yard line. Comes back 14 yards to the 20, is stopped by Fair as the first period ends with Syracuse leading 10 to two. LSU is held on three ground plays at the start of the second quarter, and with fourth and four, Buster Brown punts to the Syracuse 18-yard line. Mealy picks it up, returns eight yards to the Orange men's 26. The punt was good for 56 yards from scrimmage. A stiff LSU defense forces Syracuse to kick back. Killerin grounds the ball, the kick good for 37 yards. LSU in the attack, screen hands off to Fambro, gains one, but Syracuse is offsides in this play and suffers a five-yard penalty for the LSU 39. First and five, screen pitches back to DeBetta at left end. He's run out of bounds by Rowan Holman for no gain. Screen pitches back to DeBetta. He tries right guard and gains four to the Tiger 43. Archer making the stop. 
Third and one, LSU. Screen hands off to the better. He hits right guard and gains three to the LSU 46, and it's a first down. Hunter making the stop. Screen hands off to the better again. At left guard, he's thrown for a two-yard loss by Stecker. Second and 12 now for the Tigers. Screen hands off to DeBetta. He goes over right guard, picks up three to the LSU 47, stopped by Chayonsky. Third and nine, that screen fakes. Runs to his right, finally passes to Don Schwab. It's good for 15 yards and a first down in the Syracuse 38, stopped by Brown. LSU is unable to sustain a drive, however, after three attempts. With fourth and 18, Buster Brown punts to the Syracuse two-yard line. is grounded by Fussell. This kick good for 44 yards. Again, the tough Tiger defense forces Syracuse to kick. On fourth and six, Rich King, punting from his own end zone, boots to the Syracuse 42. Joe Labruzzo signals for a fair catch. The kick good for 36 yards. LSU on offense, Green drops back. He passes to Labruzzo. Labruzzo's in the open, but he overshoots the mark. Second and ten, screen the quarterback, fakes and fades. Passes to Labruzzo, but it's overthrown and out of bounds. With third and ten, screen rolls to the left. His pass intended for Barron is intercepted by Holman on the Syracuse 31 and returned four yards to the Orange Man 35 where Barron makes the tackle. Syracuse unable to move after a run and two incomplete passes. With fourth and seven, King punts to the LSU 12-yard line. Bruzo goes back to pick it up and returns to the LSU 16. Fair making the tackle. The kick good for 50 yards. Tigers ball, first and 10. Billy Ezell at quarterback. He hands off to Labruzzo at left end. And Joe gains eight yards to the LSU 24. Holman making the tackle. Second and two, Tigers. Ezell hands off to Schwab. At right guard, he finds a hole and goes for 11. It's a first down on the LSU 35. Holman again makes the tackle. But LSU's unable to make the first down, and with fourth and five, goes into deep punt formation. Buster Brown punts to the Syracuse 18-yard line. Lloyd Little gets it, returns two to the Orange Man's 20. Trostler making the stop. The kick good for 42 yards. Rich King, the quarterback, hands off to Floyd Little. At right guard, he picks up four to the Syracuse 24. Rice making the stop. King hands off to Jim Nance at left guard. He gains one to the Syracuse 25. Stopped by Simmons as the second period ends with Syracuse leading 10 to 2. A colorful halftime pageant unfolds to entertain the New Year's Day throng. Under the baton of band director Edward Holt, the Syracuse University Band performed. LSU's marching band, directed by Bill Swar, is next on the field. Jackson Donaldson and Edward Michael Packenham, descendants of the famed generals, in the observance of the Battle of New Orleans sesquicentennial celebration. And now we're ready for the third quarter. Brudem kicks off for LSU to the Syracuse 10 as the second half begins. Healy fumbles the ball but recovers in the Orange Man's 19 yard line. Wally Maley is the Syracuse quarterback. He hands off to Jim Nance, who gains nine at left guard to the Syracuse 28, stopped by Vincent. Second and one, Maley pitches back to Nance, but this time he's halted with no gain by Prudhomme. 
That makes it third down and one yard to go. Neely gives it to Nance again. This time he roars through for seven and a first down at the Syracuse 35, stopped by Pillow. Failing to make a first down, Syracuse with fourth and four. King punts to the LSU 25. Graves fumbles the ball, but recovers for no return. He stopped by Killerin. The kick was for 34 yards. LSU takes over. Billy Ezell, the quarterback, hands off to Don Schwab. He gains eight at left tackle to the Tiger 33, stopped by Holman. The second and two, Ezell hands off to Schwab again. He gets one yard to the LSU 34, Smith and Everling making the stop. Third and one, Ezell gives to Labruzzo. And he picks up three yards in the first down at the LSU 37. Chiatsky making the tackle. Ezell hands off to Schwab. He moves over right guard for two to the LSU 39. Chiatsky making the stop. Billy Ezell, the quarterback, rolls out to the left. Looks for Labruzzo. Throws. Good for 10 yards. And the first down on the LSU 49. Smith makes a tackle. Ezell gives to Schwab. He gets seven yards of the Syracuse 44. Holman, the tackler. Second down, three to go for the Tigers. Ezell gives to Labruzzo. At right tackle, he picks up two to the Syracuse 42. But LSU suffers a 15-yard holding penalty to the Tiger 43. So it's second down, 16 yards to go. Billy Ezell back, fakes a pass, throws in a second effort. Morrow is clear. He gets past the Syracuse secondary, catches the ball in the Syracuse 25, and he goes all the way. The touchdown play is good for 57 yards. At this point, LSU decides to go for the two-point play. Billy Ezell's pass to Joe Labruzzo is complete for the two-point conversion, and it ties the game. Syracuse 10, LSU 10. Cox kicks off for LSU to the Syracuse 10. And after a 13-yard return by Maley to the Orange Men's 23, with the first and 10, Maley hands off to Jim Nance at left tackle. He gains seven to the Syracuse 30, Collie and Vincent making the stop. Maley, the quarterback, hands to Duckett. On a reverse at left guard, he gains five to the Syracuse 35, and it's a first down, stopped by Majori. Maley hands the fullback Nance, and he roars up the middle 20 yards to the LSU 45. It's a first down for Syracuse. Colley made the tackle. Neely gives to Duckett. Up the middle he goes for four yards to the LSU 41. Rodriguez makes the stop. Neely hands to Nance at right guard. He picks up three more to the Tiger 38. Rodriguez again makes the tackle. And that makes it third and three for Syracuse. Neely the quarterback. Fakes and swings to the left. He circles left end for four yards, enough for a first down on the Tiger 34-yard line. Vincent rolls him out. Neely fakes the handoff, keeps it, then pitches back to Little. He tries right end, but he's thrown for a three-yard loss by Moore. That makes it second and 13. Neely fakes and passes. It's complete the Crips for six yards to the Tiger 31. Collie makes the tackle. Third and seven for Syracuse. Neely drops back. He throws intended for Crips, but it's incomplete. So it's fourth down, seven to go, and King goes for it with a pass. He throws to Crips, complete for 12, and a first down on the Tiger 19. Joseph makes the tackle. Rich King, the quarterback, hands to Nance. He picks up two of the LSU 17, stopped by Trostler. Neely gives to Nance again. This time at right tackle, he gains four to the LSU 13. Tackle by Rodriguez. Third down, four yards to go for Syracuse. The ball in the Tiger 13. Neely fakes the handoff. Passes intended for Cripps, and it is intercepted by Graves on the LSU 5. He gets back to the six where he's knocked out by Cripps. Ezell hands off to Schwab at left guard. Good for five yards of the LSU 11 as the third period ends with a score tied. Syracuse 10, LSU 10. Ezell hands off to Schwab as the fourth period begins and Schwab gains two to the LSU 13. Third and three for the Tigers. Ezell keeps it this time. Drives off left guard for five yards of the LSU 18 and it's a first down. After three runs, failed to produce another first down with fourth and two. Buster Brown punts to the Syracuse 31. 
Lloyd Little takes it and returns to the Orange Men 34. But Syracuse is penalized 15 yards for clipping to their own 20. Rich King in at quarterback. Mealy has moved to halfback. King pitches back to Mealy, and he's held for no gain by Majori. Second and 10 for Syracuse. King keeps it this time. Goes over right tackle for a yard to the Syracuse 21. Stopped by Moore. It's third and nine for the Orange Men. King the quarterback. Drops back and completes a four-yard pass to Mealy. He laterals to Nance on the Syracuse 26. Nance roars on for nine yards and a first down on the Orange Men's 34. But here the LSU defense stiffens, and after two runs and an incompleted pass with fourth and four, King punts to the LSU 19. Joe Labruzzo gathers it in on a bounce, returns for nine yards to the LSU 28, stopped by McCard, the kick good for 41 yards. That screen, the Tiger quarterback hands off to Gawain DeBetta. He stopped for no gain by Jajuga. Then screen pitches out to DeBetta. But Gawain is trapped and thrown for a two-yard loss by Smith on the LSU 26. Third and 12 now for the Tigers. Screen keeps it. Takes off around right end and gets loose for 23 yards and a first down on the LSU 49. He's run out of bounds finally by Smith. Green passes now to Doug Morrow to flip out into the flat. He's thrown for a three-yard loss by Smith. Second down, 13 yards to go for the Tigers. Screen back to throw again. He passes to DeBetta in the right flat. Complete for no gain. Brock makes the stop. That makes it third and 13. Screen back to throw once more. Looking for Labruzzo. It's complete for 35 yards and a first down on the Syracuse 19. Holman makes the tackle. Green hands off to Labruzzo this time. He tries right end and picks up two to the Syracuse 17. Second down, eight yards to go for the Tigers. Screen pitches back to DeBetta. Wayne sweeps right end for six yards to the Syracuse 11. However, LSU has penalized five yards for illegal procedure to the Syracuse 16. With third and seven, Screen under center. Keeps the ball, swings around left end for five yards, back to the Syracuse 11 where he stopped by Smith. That makes it fourth down and two yards to go. Ezel comes in to hold the ball and Doug Morrow kicks a 28-yard field goal from a side angle. With three minutes, 50 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter, LSU leads Syracuse 13 to 10. Cox kicks off for LSU to the Syracuse 24. Elliott takes it on the big bounce and returns nine yards to the Orange Men's 33 where he stopped by majority. Rich King is the quarterback for Syracuse. He fakes, then pitches back to Little. Cuts over right tackle for a gain of four to the Syracuse 37. Second down, six yards to go. King passes this time. It's complete to Elliott. Good for three yards. All in the Syracuse 40 where Vincent makes the tackle. Third and three. King on a delayed play, gives to Nance. He moves for four yards and a first down on the Syracuse 44, stopped by Rodriguez. Quarterback King drops back to pass. He throws it, intended for Floyd Little. But it's out of bounds and incomplete. Second down, 10 yards to go for Syracuse, fighting to get back into the game. King drops back the throw. His pass is intended for Nance, but it overshoots the mark. That'll make it third and 10. King on a pitch back. Bailey takes it. He throws. Intended for Clark, and it overshoots the mark. So it's fourth down, 10 yards to go. One more chance for the Orange Men. King, the quarterback, back to pass again. It's intended this time for Floyd Little, but broken up by Rice, and LSU takes over on downs on Syracuse's 44 with a minute 45 left to play now. Ezell hands off to Schwab at the middle. It's a gain of three to the Syracuse 41. Ezell gives to Schwab at right guard. He gains seven to the Syracuse 34, and the Tigers have another first down. Chayensky makes the tackle. Ezell gives to Schwab again. He punches out four more to the Syracuse 30. Smith makes the stop. Time running out. Second down, six to go for the Tigers. Ezell fakes and rolls. Goes over right guard for seven more, and another first down in the Syracuse 23. Smith stops him. Ezell gives it to Schwab at left guard. He gains three to the Syracuse 20, and he's stopped by Eberling as the game ends. LSU coach Charlie McClendon is congratulated by Syracuse coach Ben Schwartzwalder as LSU wins 13 to 10. 
And now we take you to the finale of the Sugar Bowl's 31st annual extravaganza, the Players' Awards Party following the game. Syracuse and LSU players are presented awards by past president A.B. Nicholas. President A. Theomas presents the Sugar Bowl trophy to coach Charles McClendon of LSU. Charles Zadron, past president, awards the trophy to coach Ben Schwartzwalder of Syracuse University. Sam Carnsweat Sr., chairman of the executive committee, presents the most valuable player award to flanker back Doug Morrow of LSU. And here's the Sugar Bowl queen, Miss Lynn Bowman, and pageant chairman, Erwin F. Poche. Why don't you plan to visit New Orleans, historic city of charm and culture, the home of the Sugar Bowl.